Hello guys, welcome back. I'm Yusuf Shakil and you are watching HTML Tutorials. In this video, we are going to learn about HTML images. So let's get started. I have opened brackets and now I'll go ahead and create a new file and I will name this images.html and I will write the following HTML. So we have the doc type HTML, opening and closing HTML tag, opening and closing head tag. We have set the title to images and we have the body tag. Now let us open the live preview. In HTML, we use the IMG tag to display image. So let us go ahead and create an image tag. And in order to display an image, we have to set the SRC attribute of the image tag to the link or the URL of the image file that we want to display. In this case, I'm going to use DY Classroom logo image. So you can see we have the image of DY Classroom. We can also use the alt attribute in the image tag. The value of the alt attribute is shown when the image fails to load. So for example, let's say we have an image tag and we have set the SRC attribute value to DY Classroom logo. And we have set the alt attribute value to DY Classroom logo. So this is a valid URL and hence we are getting the image but let's say if we have an invalid URL or if we have a URL and unfortunately the image fails to load then in that case we'll get an output like this. We won't get the image but we'll get a text which is equal to the value of this alt attribute. We can also set the width and height of an image using the width and height attribute. So for example, let's say we have an image and we have the SRC attribute set to DY Classroom logo. And this time we want the width of the image to be 200 pixels. So we'll set the value of the width attribute to 200. And let's say we want the height of the image to be, let's say 100 pixels. So we'll set the height attribute value to 100. The value of this width and height attribute is in pixels. We can also use percentage. So let's say we have another image tag and we have set the SRC value to DY Classroom logo. And this time we have set the width value to let's say 80% and height to let's say 30%. We can also create image link. For that, we use an anchor tag and inside the anchor tag, we use an image tag. So we'll set the SRC value of the image tag to the URL of the DY Classroom logo and in the opening anchor tag, we'll set the href value to the URL of DY Classroom. So now this image is a link. So when we click on this image, it will take us to dyclassroom.com. All right, guys, this brings us to the end of this tutorial. I'll post the tutorial notes on my website, dyclassroom.com. The link will be in the description. And the code that we are writing in this tutorial series, I'll put them in my GitHub repository. The link will be in the description, so please check that out. 
and if you think this video is interesting then please subscribe my channel and please give this video a like all right guys thank you so much for watching i'll see you in the next video and like always stay happy and keep smiling bye